Hey, shit. come on, move, fucko. Uh. Hey, asshole, look out the way. Ah. Look the fuck out. That's my ride, bitch. We ah. ah. let's go. Ah. Oh, fucking man. Right. Nice fucking fight. You got three seconds to move your ass. Damn, yeah, motherfucker. Ah. Y yo soy el Mexican Institute of Sound. And you're listening to Islos FM. because you think that I am an Arab. What? No. What are you talking about? Something like that. Excuse me. Wait. That oh, wait, boy. I, I... I am his mentor. I am so proud of you. What do you mean, a mentor? Don't worry about that. Okay, so what you got for him? James De Santa. Some kid. He is already late on his payments, and I have this bad feeling that he will do more damage to the car than we can get back from him in the exorbitant interest rate payments. Huh? Just go and get it. The house is on um, uh, Hampstead uh, off Eclipse. It's an SUV. Yeah. Some Rockford Hills daddy's boy nonsense. Don't worry about it. Try to bring the car back in good condition, huh? I got you. Don't worry about it. It's so good to see you, my boy. Hey, good luck in uh, law school, huh? So, Mr. Kenneth, were we at uh, financing? Financing it, it seems like a shitty deal. Ah, because of the color of my skin, you think I am a scammer.
Hey, did you change your mind? When I discover that you betray me, perhaps. I hear you took the bike for yourself, my employee of the month. Listen, man, me and Lamar was gonna get that back to you, dawg. Oh, I am sure. You will get this car off the daddy's boy, and then we talk. Insurance papers say they have a locked garage, so you'll need to gain access from inside the house. Man, it's never easy with you, is it, Simi? Do not talk to me about easy, you thief. God, I just love existential anguish. And quite frankly, who doesn't these days? Remember, I got there first. I was suffering. Black Strobe, an electro class group from Paris. DJ George, and yes, I do know him. Mr. De Santa, there is someone here!
It's just because you have a massive gaper, bitch. Fucking homo, you're dead. Dead! He said I had a massive... Jimmy called me a bitch! Now just loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? Yeah, loosen them up. There you go. And follow through. Perfect. Uh oh, okay. I think I'm getting... <laughs> ah! Who the fuck are you? Can I help you? Oh, hey. Do something! Help. Fucking help. do something! to knife attack me? No one creeps on the J-Dog, my niggas. I'll cut your dick off if you call the administrator. Hey, you know what? I am the administrator. Attack me? No one creeps. <laughs> oh well, you suck Batman's dick. Dead, you fucking idiot. I still love him though. Sort of. <gasps> Who the fuck are you? to knife attack me? Ooh, slaughter time! Oh my god, seriously? My brother is such a homo. I think he has a medical problem. Like, more medical problems than the ones he's already been diagnosed with. <laughs> Thank you, coach. You're a real pro, Mrs. DeSanta. A real pro. You know, you're a great student. Now just loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? Yeah, loosen them up. There you go. And follow through. Perfect. Uh oh, okay. I think I'm getting it. Okay, Amanda. Uh, now just follow through. God, you've got great hips. You know that? Follow through. 
Yeah, I could get used to this. Hey, Simeon, I got the ride, man. I'm coming back. Yeah, if you actually bring the repossession to me this time, I can have it back out on the street before the day is done. That's a 9mm semi-automatic pushed against your skull. Right. Now look around. You just keep driving where you're going. Hey, come on, man. This was a repo job. Guy was behind on his fucking note. Unlikely, considering my son just got the car. And looking at the way you're going about this, my guess, you're working a credit fraud. Credit fraud? Be serious, dude. I just worked the fucking repo. I appreciate a kid who follows orders without taking responsibility. Yeah, maybe one day we'll have a beer, and I'll explain how the world really works. Who gives you the slip? A car. Watch it! A car dealer, dog, by the name of Simeon Yateri. So this businessman, he look legit to you? Look, man, it's just between him and your fucking son. Don't worry. Me and Mr. Yatarian, we'll work this out. What are you, a fucking idiot? Me and Mr. Yatarian, we'll work this out. Hey man, it's Jess up here. Okay, stop the car. Pull up. That the place? Yeah, this the place, man. Whoa. Drive into it. Right through the fucking window. And fast. Or I'll put two rounds in the back of your skull and do it myself. Man, you can't be for real. I look like a fucking joke to you. Man. Fuck my life, man. Fuck it. Do it. Whatever. Come on, kid. Shitty situations, dog! Franklin! What the fuck are you doing? Mr. Sammy, it's not exactly how it looks. I always trump big for a job well done. Now get out of here, kid. You motherfucker! See now, you've pissed me off! Fraudster pup! You recognize this car? Huh? Does it look like it's worth five grand? Get out! Oh, oh. 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 
already rocking hard, Los Santos. You don't have to sell out. Satellite news feed. Enjoy. Breaking news. A gang shootout in Puerto del Sol. Excitement is building for Life Invaders' new product launch. A breakthrough in the notorious Leonora Johnson case. The Sonora Desert, a hotbed for illegal arms trafficking from south of the border. Is the paparazzi going out of business? Some hope so. A quiet cul-de-sac erupted in gang violence yesterday as a bloody massacre left several Vagos gang members dead. A trail of don't devastation and no clear idea what happened or why. Police don't know if this means drug wars between Hispanic gangs have reignited or if this was simply a deal or an altercation gone terribly wrong. The smuggling of weapons from the U.S. into Mexico has transformed the Senora Desert region into a war zone in recent months, with rival traffickers including including Mexican gang Varios Los Aztecas and El Salvadorian gang the Marabunta Grande clashing over supply routes. The launch of life in...
whatever you want. Man, I'll come by for that drink you offer, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. <laughs> okay. You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look, I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years, and I got out alive. That makes me the right age. <clears throat> you look like a good kid. But if you want my advice, give the shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately, and maybe, just maybe, if you're lucky, you become a... We're taking my wife's car. Hey, Jim. I'm going for a drink, Dad, Rick. shit! I mean, our boat going down the Western Highway! It's... it's been stolen! What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane! All right, I'm coming. For my boat! All righty, then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. 